guys, I'm Allison. And I'm Emily, and you're watching Forever. Forever. And today, I'm picking out Emily's outfits for a whole week of school. She's now a sophomore in high school, and honestly, I think she has better style than me now. I do. She does. That's what I'm worried about a little bit. She likes to go to school very just last minute, throws on anything. Do you make your outfits the night before? Sometimes, yeah. Most of the time, yeah. I don't. I wake up, put on a shirt, put on a pair of jeans, put on shoes, and go. I don't think my outfits are bad. I think better they're than bad. last year. No, yeah, they're definitely better than at the end of the year. They're yeah. still pretty good right now. I'm still wearing jeans every single day. Like, that's, I that's wore impressive. sweatpants for the first time yesterday, but I'm like been wearing jeans every day. Yeah. So honestly, I think I'm doing good. But she definitely has a little bit more taste. Also, because she does her hair. She yeah. does her hair like every single day. I don't do my and hair. And that ever. really pulls the outfit together. Yeah. Guys. Today she has like a little slick back going I on. I have a braid. I but don't. I, took it out. I have five day old greasy hair that so I just I can't like, do that brush. with my natural hair. Her hair's curly. So it's just. We're different. So I'm gonna be picking out her outfits today for school. You guys liked this video when we did it last year. And if you guys wanna see the opposite where she picks out my outfits, let us know right down below. But let's go over to her closet and pick out five outfits for a full week of school. But before Allison picks out my outfits, we're gonna introduce today's sponsor, Setbird. We've talked about them before and they came on trips with us and now the school is back in session. We are bringing them to school in our little emergency kits. They are the perfect little size to throw into any little bag, especially your emergency kit for school. We both have lifting this year and yeah. we like actually work out. She gets to go home right after yeah. she works out, but I have it first period. So right after I work out, I am sweaty, I stink, and I just like, I'm like, oh my gosh, I can smell myself. So I just pop open my backpack and put on my Semperd and it's just perfect for on the go. If you guys haven't heard us talk about Semperd before, they're a monthly subscription company. It lets you try out various perfumes before committing to a full size bottle. They are so affordable, you can get your first month for $8 using our code right here on the screen. And the packaging is so cute. They're always in different colors. I always get questions at school when I whip it out in my second period and I'm like, shh, 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 right after lifting, they're like, oh my gosh, that's so cute. Where is it from? And I'm like, Semperd. Typically a full size bottle is 300 to $500 and you don't know if you're truly gonna like it. So Semperd is the perfect option to kind of just test out the waters and find your signature scent. The one that I just put on is the Victoria's Secret Teas Perfume and it smells so good. It shows you right here on the card that you can also see on the website what the ingredients are and like what the scents are. So this one has white gardenia, pear and black vanilla. We've been testing out different fragrances from Scentbird for a couple months now and we've kind of narrowed down like what we like and what we don't like. But if you're new to figuring out your scent, you guys can take the little quiz on their website and figure out what it is you like and what you don't like. If you like sweeter scents or darker scents, my mom likes like harsh, dark scents where me and Emily are fruity, flory, and like floral, 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 and floral. vanilla. Yeah, love vanilla, vanilla, love all those scents. So if you guys are interested in checking out Semperd, you guys can use our code right here on the screen to get your first month for $8 and use our link right down below in the description or scan the QR code on the screen. So stock up your emergency kit for school with a Semperd to always smell good and fresh while also finding your signature scent. If you're interested in checking out Semperd, use our code SISTER55OFF to get your first month for $8. Now let's go pick out Emily's back to school outfits. All right, we made it over to Emily's room. Here's her closet full of clothes, full of shoes. She likes to match her outfits very well. Yes, I do. Somehow this girl has style out of nowhere. I don't know. But she's kind of like my inspiration because I'm like, I can't go to school looking like a bum if she's over here with her hair slicked back, all her jewelry on. I'd be like, stupid. Drive the driver. Yeah, yeah I'm no. just like the Uber driver. And it's like, bye, Allison. No, I started doing that because it was like freshman year, like, you know, start of the year, you always try to look good. And then my friends were like, oh my gosh, I'm like, I love seeing your outfits every day. You always have something cute on. So Those are like, my shoes. I know, I took them from my video. Okay. Um, but anyways, I was like, I need to like keep up the reputation. Like they're all expecting no, me to keep I up the outfit. I have the opposite reputation. I remember it was my sophomore year or my freshman year. I came to school with like sweatpants and a hoodie like on the third day of school and they were like, are you okay? Like is something going on? And I'm like, no. And she's like, why do you look like that? I was like, I'm comfortable. I but probably now, wore that once I last year. I kind of just feel like, no, like I can't look like a bum. So <laughs> here we here. are. So Emily's by are you? Yes, because I can't walk out the door out of my room in the morning and she's like full glam. <laughs> and then I look like a bum. Because like, no, we have to keep up the reputation as sister, yeah. sister forever. We look good together and not bad together. <laughs> so anyways, let's start picking out her outfits. Comment down below which, like, which person you are. I'm usually like the bum, the one who doesn't dress up for school. She's usually the put together one. So which one are you? Allison or Emily? Hashtag Emily. Hashtag Allison. I feel like most people are like you. Hashtag Allison for sure. Like they're like I get towards over you. cute. I get like you towards the end of the year. 
Yeah, I don't know how long I'm gonna put up this like this jeans every single day. Right now, I really like my jeans. Like I got these jeans from Addicted, and I love them, so I've been like wearing them all the time. But anyways, let's start with Emily's outfits. I'm gonna start it off a little bit casual, but still cute for Monday because Monday blues are just like nobody wants to be there. I want to wear this hoodie because honestly, I want to steal this for myself. I just got this from it Dandy. It is gorgeous. I love Dandy worldwide so much, but it is so hot out here, like. It is not fall weather but yet. But like honestly, the hallways, like in classrooms, have been really cold. Okay, but no, because did you were were you at school today? Because remember yeah, when you stepped outside, it was like oh no, oh my today, gosh, like, outside it was the worst is really thing hot. ever. It was like you just stepped into a steam room. Like it was so unbelievably foggy. Oh my gosh, why is the sun out now? Oh my gosh. But anyways, cool. this is definitely not for like right now because if you wore this to school, I think you would I would die. probably die. Like I actually have a heat stroke. But it's gorgeous. I the love the it. fact that like it's like distressed looking. Like it's so cute. It says dandy right here on the sleeve. On the front it says Southern California. Yes. And then worldwide flower shop. So cute. And then on the back. Are you kidding? Look at yacht. that. It's it is so just so pretty. beautiful. The detail in it. it. These are like the perfect winter hoodies because they're so thick and they're so comfortable. But not for Florida in September. Okay, so we might have to hold off, but this was like the ideal hoodie. It's just so gorgeous. So first hoodie and then to go with that, we're going to pick out a pair of jeans. But she's going to go with that. You just say it's hot. Well, she's she wants to kill up. me. She wants to kill me. <laughs> what are you looking for? Because I can help. Okay, I think I'm going to go Light wash. Just because look how simple they are. Like the hoodie itself does everything. Oh, and these are like a cross. Okay, that's cute. You're not going to be able to see it because like yeah. the hoodie. But these are from Abercrombie and Fitch. They are just like a light denim wash, and I love light denim wash. I don't like any other wash, really, like dark wash or black. I like dark wash and black, but I like light no, wash the light most, wash I is think. the best. So here we have these really, really basic jeans. They're just like straight jeans. Mm -hmm. So I think it would be cute with the hoodie because it's not like too oversized because it's like oversized on oversized I don't like. Yeah. I'm usually like a... Tight top, oversized pants, or, or tight pants, oversized top. Yeah. So this is like a good combo with that. So here you go. And lastly, we obviously need a pair of shoes. So I'm thinking something still basic because I feel like the hoodie is like everything. But we'll see what she has. I want to use these because like it would kind of give like cute pastels. Like the color in the top and then like these on the bottom. Because it's like purple, but it's not like purple like it's like light purple she doesn't like that idea no i don't i what would, would you wear i would personally white converse wear that. yeah i would i just think this would be cuter than white converse well we'll see we'll try it on okay let's just try that one right now you thought you were gonna wait no you're gonna try <laughs> it on right now wait can i do a transition ready, ready guys we're gonna do the little jump we'll do, we'll do a different transition every three two one Booyah! Outfit number one. I didn't feel like tying the shoes, but I actually think they look pretty good with it. Shoes, Nike Dunks in purple. Oh wait, you already said where the jeans are from, but I actually looked at this and I was like, it actually works. Like I see what she was saying, like the little kind of pastel-y kind of look. And this hoodie, so comfortable guys. Love it. A moment for the back. So cute. I'm gonna steal that one this like fall and winter. No. Girl, you wear all of my hoodies. I see you in my room every single night. So no, yeah, guys, no. I literally, I'm running out of outfit options because like, I don't want to repeat outfits just yet. So I've been going into her closet, but. So how do you rate that one? How do we feel about the outfit? Um, for winter, I would definitely wear something like this in winter. I think I'd give it seven and a half. Like, cause like you said, the little like loose on loose isn't the best. But it's still kind of cute. Time for me to pick the next outfit. Tuesday. Number two, we're at Tuesday. Tuesday, Tuesday. H O T T O G O. Miss you, New York take girls. Me hot to go. That song is trending, but guys, we heard about this song from our friend. That song was trending when we had learned about it, like back in July. Oh, but I didn't start hearing it until now. Yeah, those ones remind us of our New York girls. Are they on this wall? They probably are. Yeah, they are. Wait, Wait oh, look, they're right here. Right here. Look, our New York girls, if you're watching. We that's one you. of them. Madison the and then Mila's that right was, there. That, this is Mila. Oh. And Mila and Madison. That's Gabby. Oh, that's Gabby? Okay, that wait. That's Gabby. Where is... Oh, there she is. Mila's right there. <laughs> okay. Anyways, outfit number two. It's Tuesday now. Think 
in a different week. It's Tuesday. She just wore this on Monday. So she's probably going to be like, oh crap, I just learned my lesson. It's way too hot to wear that. So we're going to go with something more breezy, more casual, more breathable. So we're going to go with a little, get out of my way, a little top. A little like crop top. Not too cropped because I've already gotten dress coded before and we're not having that again. Okay, we're thinking fall. We're thinking that we're going to be a fall. little pumpkin today. So we have this top. It is from, I think this is Urban Outfitters. Yeah, I think so. I wore this only once last year. I actually think it's kind of cute. I, I wore it during Halloween. Well, clearly. So yeah, we're going to put this as a top so you can hold that. Let's see if she picks out the same outfit that I wore last year with it. Okay, I'm thinking dark so no. wash jeans because it's like fall. Oh yeah, I like. That looks really good, right? I wore black jeans with this last year. Okay, no, that's giving too Halloween. Well, because I wore it during Halloween. Yeah, but still, like no. Too Halloween. Too Halloween, <laughs> like too festive. All right, so these are the jeans. Now let me think. Okay, shoes. Shoes. Okay, we could obviously go with yeah. basic, like these, but I just, I don't think so. So... But honestly, oh, not those. No, no, I, I don't. Kidding. She I was, was looking kidding. at my blazers. I do not like those personally. No. I think we're going to go to my closet then because that's all you have here. So let's run to my closet real quick. I'm thinking the high top white Converse. I have a ton of shoes and she's always in here stealing them. So, okay, honestly, we're going to keep it basic. And we're gonna go with these platform white Converse because they add more than like the other white Converse she has. So we're gonna go with these. Oh my god, I hate those guys. Oh, <laughs> why? Cause um, when you wear them, this part like in the middle, it oh, always to slides side. to the side, and it's so annoying. Yeah, I wish I had like the fabric one, but I have like the leather ones. So if I ever like want to get new ones, I'm gonna get the fabric ones. But I don't really wear these that often anymore. I actually wore them to school today, but. Anyways, okay, second okay. outfit. What is your transition gonna be? We're gonna do a little spin. Okay. We're gonna go a little lower so you can see more of the fit. Are you guys ready? Yeah, here's outfit number, number two. two. This outfit, don't like that much. Um, okay, fix your shoes. Like, what is no, that? guys, it has nothing to do with the shoes. No, just put the jeans over them. You wouldn't wear it like uh, that. Well, that's not the part. That I don't like. I know. I have the same issue with them. I just don't think the colors really go. You don't think? I personally wouldn't wear them. What this. would you wear? My black jeans. Or maybe white. White or black. I think the blue looks good. Also, I would very much get dress coded for this. Unless I'm like pulling it down all day. But yeah, I think I'm going to have to give this one a six. A six. Yeah. All right. So you well, might want to up your game a little. Actually, no. So yeah, let's hope she does a little bit better on this one. See, that's where you got it all wrong. It doesn't look bad as bad on camera. No, it's really person. not bad. I don't know where you think it's bad. Rate it down below which outfit you think is the best so far in like each outfit, because I don't think this is bad. The more I look at it, the more I like kind of like it. So we'll go up to a six and a half. Okay. Well, next up is Wednesday, and Wednesday calls for wacky on Wednesday. Wednesday on Wednesdays, we wear pink. Well, we'll wear pink and we'll be wacky. So, to start it off, we're going to do the opposite of what we usually do. Actually, no, we're going we're gonna to stick to the routine. Let's pick out a shirt first. And since you want to wear pink, Hello. we wear pink. I have a lot of pink, so. Yes, you do. Look at the pink collection. There's quite a but bit half of half of them I can't even wear. Yeah, they're mostly tank tops. But let's figure it out what we want to wear on this pink day. Okay, there's this shirt that she has her, like, neck cut off which i think could be cute i wear that to the beach usually that's a possibility or um, not already not feeling it okay there's this okay that could be cute okay um, oh we're having options today yeah we do okay there's this this is love cute. that this is real cute it's very light pink but it's hard to see on camera yeah so those are our three options for pink and then we're gonna look at jeans so we're gonna go with these. Blue. Girl. It is really Ooh, wacky. Oh. Guys, they're very wrinkly. Actually, just kidding. Oh. Just kidding. We're gonna go with white. We're gonna go. Are you gonna go with the ones I wore on the first day of school? Oh, no. Just kidding. We're gonna go okay, with Okay, yeah. These be ones. more original, please. Hello? This is what she does in my closet, guys. She leaves a mess. Okay, so we're gonna go with these white jeans from Love american those. eagle we're not gonna do the shirt that she wants to do because this isn't giving very wacky already so okay. i don't know what you mean okay so i'm okay with okay. that okay okay we're gonna wear this sweater because on wednesdays we wear pink 
Okay, I would wear that. That looks cute, right? Yeah, I would wear that. Right. All right, back it up. Oh gosh, is she gonna come in with some crazy shoes or something? I would yeah. wear something like this, so. Yeah. For All right. And for the shoes. Oh my god. We're gonna wear some cowboy boots. Yeah. You know people actually wear these to school? Yeah, I know. We have weird kids at our school. No, they're not weird. They're no, original. They're country. They're original. <laughs> they're original. Yeah, they are. All right. All right. Wait, we're gonna do a little little cowgirl transition since we got boots. Let's do it. What are you gonna do? You ready? Okay, guys. Outfit. Um, I would not choose to tuck these jeans in, but you know, Allison said to. <laughs> but all gonna be done. <laughs> if you go from like here up, the outfit's cute, like the jeans in the top, cute for winter. But then you look at the shoes. You look bad. <laughs> Got the hat to tie it all in, guys. This is a 10 out of 10 outfit, guys. <laughs> Just kidding. Um, but without the boots, I'd actually give this like a like an eight, I think. Cute. cute. I'd wear this. Just definitely different shoes. All right. Ooh. Now it's Thursday. And we already went crazy on Wednesday. So we're going to go simple because, like, Thursday, like, you're just trying to get to Friday. Okay. Okay. So we're trying to get to Friday. So we're going to keep it casual, keep it simple, keep it fun. So we're going to go with an oversized T-shirt. Oh, my gosh. Wait. When we did this last year, you picked this exact outfit. You picked that shirt. So big like, no, I remember it. Oh, I remember. Man. If Do you guys remember when we did this video last year? If not, go watch it, and I swear she picked that exact shirt. Because I never wear it, and she had me wear it. Okay, well, then I'll pick something else. So let's do something new. Okay. Um, not one of my cheer shirts. Those What's are not. I wore those all the time in 8th grade, but that's not the vibe anymore. I also wore jeggings in 8th grade, so that says a lot. This shirt that we got from the Olivia Rodrigo concert... Okay. Pretty cute, pretty simple. I wore that last year with leggings because that's when I like didn't care anymore. Okay, so we're going to do it with these jeans from American cute. Eagle. Cute. Just a cute little... Mom jeans. Yes. And then to go with it... Tuck the shirt in a little. I'm I think I wore something like that. Basic whites. Okay, that's literally Casual an outfit. I swear, I feel like I've worn that outfit before. You probably have. I probably did. Ready? I'm going to throw What's the clothes a... on oh, to you. Oh, okay, good, good, good. Okay, ready? Three, two, one. Oh my god, I bet that was the best transition ever, guys. Okay, guys, here's the fit. Um, it honestly looks better off. <laughs> I think it's cute, though. You look cute. It's not bad. If the shirt was a little bit more oversized, I think. Yeah, it's so, just shrunk a little bit. Yeah, but it looks still good. I think it's yeah. cute. Very simple, good, like, I would Thursday wear something outfit. like this. Yeah, like, Thursday, I've run out of outfits to wear, so I just throw this on. Yeah. This is something I'd wear. i give it, like, a 7. All right, that's good. I like it. Then there's Friday. Friday at our school is pretty much like school spirit day. Yeah. Every single Friday. So you're supposed to wear like our school colors or a school shirt, something along the sorts. So we're going to throw it. I have a perfect school color. That's exactly what I was going to choose. So our school colors are maroon. So I'm going to go with this garage little maroon top. I love these tops, guys. Which she loves them. She has like so many colors. They got me dress coded, but it's okay. And to go with it, I'm just going to grab these jeans that are also from Garage, a little maroon outfit. And then for the shoes, we're just going to throw on some little black Converse because our school colors are maroon, black, and white. So Perfect. Very... A little school spirit. Very go pirates. Pirates. Woo. Woo. Okay. Transition. What should this one be? Ready? You just go like... Okay. And then it'll transition. Okay. Okay, guys. Last and final outfit. Very... Go Pirates. <laughs> Very school spirit. Very Demilio. Demilio. Demir. Demir. Very Demir. Um, this is actually something I would wear. I like it. Um, you can't really see the shoes. The shoes, I don't think I'd wear. Like, yeah, they're school spirit, but I just don't think they very, like, go with the outfit. But, like, top and jeans, I would definitely wear. We're cutting it close with the stomach, but it's okay. So, I think I would give this fit... Like an eight. It's a very good ending outfit. So overall, how do you think I did? I think you did pretty good. I think I honestly expected worse. I actually went really realistic. This is yeah. like what you would actually wear, except for Wacky Wednesday, which you would wear the outfit just minus the boots. Yeah. <laughs> this could be used as some inspo for school. Our favorite thing to do is just basic tops like this and jeans. Yes. And the Converse are really good shoes, and then we love gazelles. So. And Burks. Burks are always we a love good class. Revenge. 
Next week. Oh, revenge. yes. I, I did Revenge for what? I literally didn't well, even no, do anything back. Well, no, but she's going to do it good, too. Hopefully. Yeah. But anyways, comment down below what your favorite outfit was and how you think I did overall. If you guys haven't already, go over and check out Semperd, and we will see you guys in the next video. Peace out. I have an idea. <laughs> you did that No, I don't know. Por si acaso. No. We're not doing it again. <laughs> no, we're not doing it again. Here's outfit number two. Oh, d guys, don't mind the button. This button is so hard to get. Wait, I got it. Okay. Oh, wow. I'm going to redo it. It's like, stand right here so that I know where I go. Okay. <laughs> I'll be right here. Okay, I love how you steal my clothes because this is my shirt, my sweater, my everything. Ready? Yeah. Oh. Wait, let's do it one more time. I missed.